Welcome to American Mosaic from VOA Learning English. I'm Katie Weaver. Making art with found materials is not a new idea. Recycled paper, cloth, and metal goods can become important pictures and sculptures. An artist near Washington, D.C., just had her recycled art on exhibit at the Prince George's African American Museum and Cultural Center in Maryland. She uses a material found in almost any American home. June Sims reports. Plastic bags are not costly to produce. They are also strong and easy to carry. This is why they are a popular container in much of the world. But they are also a major source of pollution. It can take hundreds of years for plastic bags to break down. As they do, tiny pieces can poison soil, lakes, rivers, and oceans. So environmental experts urge people to reuse and recycle plastic bags. Maryland artist Alida Irby does just that. It starts with the morning newspaper. Miss Irby will read it later in the day. What is more important is getting that plastic bag the paper comes in. The mixed media artist recognized its rich possibilities about three years ago. And as I was taking the paper out, I felt the texture of these bags and they were soft. I just looked down and realize that it takes three to make a braid. And I'll put a few staples in here just to keep it from unraveling. Since then, Irby has been using plastic bags to create abstract lines in her artworks. Before incorporating plastic bags in her pieces, Irby used natural materials like feathers, leather, and dried plants. All those elements represent her Native American ancestry and identity, like her piece called Navajo Bundles. I was replicating a hairstyle, a Navajo hairstyle, when the hair is heavy and it's looped back on itself. I took the piece of plastic bag and looped it back onto itself and secured it with a tie. Miss Irby's neighbors praise her ability to turn trash into treasure. Some, like Charlotte Hogan, asked the artist to teach them how to create art from used plastic bags. I think it's fascinating. It's wonderful. And I do plan on sharing this with my seniors at my church. Neighbor Alita Meyer expressed surprise. I never gave any more thought to what to do with a plastic bag. Uh, yeah, this is definitely different. Shirley Watts also lives in the neighborhood. She plans to show others her art. I want to make a masterpiece that I can put in a frame and put it up on my wall, and then I know that I did it. Alida Irby says anyone can do it. I think that we are all artists, really, and, and, um, and there's beauty all around us. The artist says all you have to do is open your eyes and bring the outside in. I'm June Sims. And I'm Katie Weaver. Join us again next week for another American Mosaic from VOA Learning English. <laughs>